Hey everyone, it's Mike. Um, during this video, I wanna talk about binge eating and a little bit about my story. Now, I grew up slightly overweight, maybe 20 to 30 pounds overweight, always on the chubbier side. Um, I dropped my weight when I was a teenager. However, I still had the appetite of a fat person. So there would therefore just be that time where I would you know, really just lose it and I would binge eat, drink, eat, so forth. Uh, uh, most people can really 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 like relate to this happening particularly on the weekends like you may have a very clean diet during the week and then in the on the weekends you just lose it and you get and you know you your weight just essentially bounces back so and that was my experience too there are some things you can do i'll, I'll talk about supplements um the most effective supplements they found through research for reducing binge control eating itself are 5-htp and then there, there's white kidney extract so 5-htp is a mood booster. It has a lot to do with serotonin. And what it actually does is it reduces your carbohydrate cravings. And this is a good tool. It's it's a good tool to use, for example, on those times when, you know, maybe it's late at night and you're really hungry. You can just pop a pill of 5-HTP and yeah, you just, you really have no desire to eat healthy. So you don't have your desire to eat sugary foods or eat foods high in oil, which is great, which is a good tool. But again, it's still like a magic pill and it's still something which you ha always have to have on you. It doesn't really fix, you know, what's, what's really going on in terms of your mindset. Otherwise, white kidney extract, there's some evidence showing that it can help you with carbohydrate tolerance. It can help you, you know, store your carbohydrates better. They actually, there's, I mean, there's some articles saying that it actually makes, you know, it, it's damage control, meaning you can overeat and it won't be accounted for. That's BS in my opinion. What you eat is calories in, there's no way around it. Outside of nootropics, the, the things which are most helpful I would recommend that you do if you're somebody that is suffering with binge eating are number one, have a high protein diet. Protein naturally is the most satiating macronutrient. So of carbohydrates, fat, and protein, having a high protein diet is really just gonna blunt your appetite. So the best thing are like lean proteins, egg whites, chicken breast, turkey breast, or just very, very lean meats. Even uh, like tuna is good too if you can get a good source which isn't high in mercury and all those and all that bad stuff. And then otherwise, after you binge eat, the following day, just treat it like a normal day. What most people do, and myself included for a long time, was if I had a binge eating episode, the following day, I would drop my calories dramatically. I would do a lot of cardio thinking I have to make up for it. And I had a fitness coach tell me just to not do that, just to treat the following day like a normal day. And surprisingly, that's what helped. It just helped me stay consistent. And for some reason, I don't really have the desire to binge eat anymore. That being said, I would recommend if you're on a diet, have one day where you have some psychological relief. You eat out, maybe um, just be mindful of things like oil, be mindful of things like sugar and know what works. But that, but that once week of just treating the following day like a normal day has really, really made a dramatic impact. Um, otherwise, in terms of whey protein, there's a lot of evidence showing that whey protein in itself is really gonna blunt your appetite. And I found that too, especially post-workout, if I have a little bit of whey isolate, my decisions in terms of food choices seem to be better throughout the whole day. So I, I wanna know about you guys, uh, what's your experience with binge eating? It's really, really addictive behavior and it's something that nobody really wants, right? I've heard stories about people like losing tons of weight and then you know within a couple of days of binge eating it all comes back and this is possible it's very easy to like go to a Chinese restaurant or eat at a buffet and easily pile on like four to five thousand calories and then your whole week is kind of blown away and obviously that's just really unfortunate so hope you guys found that helpful those are my tips when it comes to binge eating and I'll look forward to seeing you all next time